Hello everyone, welcome back to Trev Dog Gaming here on YouTube. This is the game Planes of Pain, and we're in Season 1, now Episode 16. Well, I'm facing... the car's facing the wrong way. I need to be going this way. I'm heading up to... Is it the Screwed Pit? We've been there before, but it's a car yard, so I'm hoping it... I've got kind of a fair few hammers on me, so I should be able to... I've got a fair few health kits too, I'm not sure why I had that many in there, but anyway. Um, oh, I, actually, hang on. Not that they weigh that much, but um, oh, I must have put some gear in here at one stage and didn't take it out, so that's not very useful. Um, <coughs> might put a couple of health kits there. Do I have one? I've got one down the bottom. Okay. Let's hop into the vehicle. See if I can go in the right direction here. Yeah, I think that's it. If I... Hang on, if I zoom out a bit... Yeah, it's in roughly that direction. Alright. So, we're filled up with fuel. Well, I didn't check just then, but I'm pretty certain we are. Um, I've got extra fuel on me, so I should be right. So it's a little bit of a distance, but it's not... shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, I see what they mean by the snail wagon part, but anyway. Still, it's transport, and it's got a bit of storage. So, the hope today is to get some uh, anti-gravity core modules. Gee, there's a lot of zombies around here. Holy dooly. Alright, where am I parking, Trev? Where am I parking? Maybe just here. Did that attract anyone? Hope not. Uh, I wonder if you can use the hammer on any of these. Coming in here where hopefully it's a little bit quieter. Alright, let's grab a hammer and try this out. So don't forget, I've found a lot of bits and pieces, but I haven't found one anti-gravity core module yet. Damn it! Everything else but... This is a pretty decent hammer I've got too. Now there's two pumps, two coils. Oh, hang on a second, this looks better. Oh. Spoke too soon. Oh, it's still going. Hang on, have I got the same car? Oh. Hang on, was that the car on top or the car... I don't know which one I was doing now. Do you get more stuff if you go to a fuller car, perhaps? Oh my goodness. I know it's still random. It's still, yeah, chance of getting stuff, but... Alright, that one's about had it. I don't know if you can repair them, but I can easily make one, so... Hang on, what... Does it, one car look different to another? Like, they're in a scrap pile. Hello? Uh... Holy dilly, that's a lot of bolts. Jeez. That was 12 in one hit. Oh my goodness. If you first started playing the game knowing this... Oh, there's two alternators. Not sure why Luna's watching me, but... No, two electronic circuits, there you go. Hey, Luna. This hammer's lasted a fair while. Ten bolts. Oh, for crap's sake. <coughs> Look at all these bolts. Hang on. I know I'm not kind of matching up the, the better quality ones, but 43, 65, 68. Where did the more... There you go. Uh, I'm not going to worry about it too much. I'll take them back home and I'll have some... Oops. Compare them all, drag them all on top of each other, all that kind of stuff. 
wish there was a way of kind of ordering that a bit better and a bit quicker. Just put them all in the one pile. A like quality of life thing, sort of thing. Um, that's 38, so it kind of looks like that at the moment. <coughs> Gee whiz, I'm almost, I'm almost full. Hang on, I had a bit of space in the car. Is that somebody... Yeah, that's a zombie, right? Looks like he's just wandering around. Anyway, um, yeah, have to try to put some stuff back in the car. Oh, yeah, it's, like, oh, it's got a fair bit of room. What's weighing the most? The bolts don't. Oh, okay, the alternators do. Uh, 56, 65. I'm not really after the scrap. I suppose I could always just drop it. That's light. Oh, these pipes would weigh a bit. Yeah, four kilos. 0.42, 4 kilos for the pumps. So what am I on? Oh, I'm drop, dropped a bit, I guess. Yeah, I've got the machine gun of the sniper on me at the moment. Oh my goodness. It's a, it's a lot of fun. Very noisy, but it's fun. Um, I know they're only light, but we'll just put this stuff back in here. Uh, coils and electronic components. You wouldn't think they'd be all that heavy. Um, I, s I suppose it doesn't matter. Just keep going. See, that to me looks like almost a full car. Oh crap. Listen, you. Oh, there is a... Oh, are they coming round because the, um, guys were shooting, maybe? Uh, there's a couple of them close by. Listen, you guys. I don't think me hitting the car with the hammer would attract them too much. You're, you're right now. <laughs> you know, you just want to bash something with a hammer. Iron scrap. No, wire, not really. Rusty nuts. Yeah, okay. Metal pipes, not particularly. Is that it? That's all I get. Hang on, what is this? This is a bike. Nothing. Oh. There's the car. Sorry guys, it is a bit dark. I can't even see properly. Iron scrap. Two bearings. Oh, two pressure modules. Okay. Now you're talking. Uh. Hmm. So going up to these whole piles of cars. Actually, oh, hang on, I'll finish this car. I've just seen the yellowish car off to the right. Maybe I should be trying that. Maybe that that's a better car. Huh. That's it. That's it for this hammer. There you go. Alright, try another one. That's pretty... Got like a high durability. Yeah, so these yellowy looking cars... Hang on. Does it make any difference? Eight bolts. Two... Oh, well, I haven't had iron sheets before. Two saw blades. Two bearings. Twenty-two rusty nuts. Six more bolts. Why wouldn't it make more sense to get the anti-gravity core modules out of a car that was m closer to being a full car? Two electronic circuits, that's not bad. Bearing, yeah. More bolts. We're going to end up having to build another base where I am at the moment, I think. And defend it and stuff like that. It's like having to make another main base. <coughs> it's kind of stupid, but... Got so much stuff. Holy dilly, so that one's had it. Um, how, what, what happens there? Like, sometimes it's red and then it all of a sudden goes good again. Hang on. Same car. 
Oh, that's it. <laughs> Fair enough. Let me put... Oh, these guys! Listen! You know what, maybe it's time just to go a bit nuts. Mind you, they're gonna hear me from miles away. Um, not that they're necessarily coming in a direct line, but one for you, one for you, one for you. Oh, here they come. Still coming. None today, thanks. Listen. Oh no. Um, you don't get yourself caught here, Trev. You come up quickly. Oh my goodness, was that not a good idea? Hang on. Come through there's all right. That's it, just line up. Sounds like you're reloading a shoddy, doesn't it? No, that's stuff I dropped. Holy crap, you are quick. I've still got that defeat 7 of 10 bone crushes, like so far. Mission. Can't do this with the, uh, the crossbow. Oh, come on! They're just like continuous. Listen, you're gonna run out sooner or later, right? <laughs> Throwing your stones at me. Let them do more of the shooting, I suppose. Uh, there's more than a few bodies here, by the way. Has it quietened down at least a little bit? Hey, Luna. Well, that was exciting. <laughs> Look how many bodies there are on the ground. Ah, oh, jeez. Maybe I should do this quietly just to stop them from... Just relentless. It's just relentless, I tell ya. Oh jeez. What's your crossfire there, Luna? Oh, will you? <laughs> Crap sake. I'm running over here somewhere. See that? That guy from up the top there shot. Oh, that was pretty cool. <laughs> Did he just trip over? That's funny. That's pretty cool when they add that into a game. Yeah, she's a hurting a bit. Listen, I'm trying to do stuff with the hams, you guys. Gonna kill her in a sec. There you go. Listen, you. One good thing is when people like Luna die, you normally get a little bit of ammo and stuff, right? Oh, I've still got 115. Jeez. Buzz off. I'm busy. Yeah, that's that's actually a, f a bit of crowd there. A few got what the? Late to the party, dude. Some of them are quicker than others, definitely. Hmm. 
Maybe I'll stay over this side. Are these cars any better? I don't know. That yellow car was giving me a fair bit of stuff. Maybe, maybe that's what... I, I don't know. Can someone please tell me? <laughs> what's the difference? Is there any difference? Because the yellow ones kind of look like they were a fuller car. Hang on. Let's go for a quick look around here. See, is that one at the top there a bit more of a full looking car? Maybe. Hang on. Let's um try this. Two iron sheets. Oh well that's sort of close. Well, I don't know. I think you only get the iron sheets out of the cars that got more gear, maybe. Two pumps. Springs. Jeez, iron scrap. Bolts. Certainly can't complain about the number of bolts you get out of these things by smacking them with the hammer. But like you say, you've got to be able to make a few to start with. That's about it, I think, Trev. One more hit, maybe. That's it. Off goes that one, and comes a new hammer. I'm just wondering, if you go through a whole car, is there more chance of getting the anti-gravity module at the bottom of your hitting it, like kind of thing, or I don't know. Gee, I'm not having much luck. Okay, so that's the car all done. All right, let's see if we can find another one of the yellow cars. There was one back around the other side. Is there any? See, they look like blue, red, kind of rusted. Oh, here's one. Here's one that looks a little bit... Uh, I don't know, maybe it's not. Oh, I'll give it a go. Springs, metal pipes... Gee, I've got to be getting full soon. Two coils. That's it for that car. Um, oh my goodness. Um, I don't know. I, I guess this is the way to do it. You just basically... If you want parts, then... Oh man, I can't believe the number of bolts. Here I was complaining there wasn't enough bolts. Didn't realise you could do this. See, it's what happens when you start another game and you're not sure how it all works. Iron, iron... Springs... Oh my goodness. I almost feel like dropping this stuff. Maybe I should. I've got that much of it anyway. Although I suppose I'll be using it for building, I don't know. Oh my goodness, these bolts. Oops. I could hear you. Did you spot me at a distance, did you? I'd like to know if someone's going to tell me, oh no, there's a, oops, there's a, you know, a particular car or place here or something where you should be looting first. You can't, hang on. I'm slowly running out of hammers though. I can't loot, with a hammer I can't smack these big cargo containers. So it really is just these piles of cars. See, I had the yellow car over there, right? So I definitely didn't do here. I think he'll leave me alone. Let's try this car. Hang on, did that? Oh yeah, that was worth it. Thought it had crapped itself, but no. Ah, uh, that hammer's gone. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, I can see what... Uh, I can see why you need to have like eight hammers. Two coil. I mean, are these the right hammers and stuff as well? I'm just trying to think outside the, the square here a bit. Is there something I'm doing wrong, or do you just. It's just very random and rare to get, perhaps?
Well, I'm certainly going to get home with a lot of parts, but just unfortunately no anti-gravity core modules. Unless I pick up one very soon. There's another hammer. I suppose I could make another hammer. That's the end of that car. There's a guy just there. Oh, that's not showing up as something I can smack. Oh, okay, I've still got the hammer on me. Alright, try this crappy car. Gee, there's zombies just there. <laughs> just the other side of the car. Well, obviously hitting something with a hammer doesn't seem to make much attraction noise. Oh, this guy is so close. Listen, look, as soon as I stand out. Where's the other guy? There was another guy just here. Oh, there he is. Hello. Goodbye. Hmm. Back to the hammer, I guess. Oh, my goodness. Look at how much stuff. I'm actually overweight now, as it is. Um, alright, let me put some of this stuff back. Well, interesting. Um, holy dilly. 3 to 33. Let's just, uh, where is it? That is unbelievable in terms of number of bolts. Uh, 60, 66, 68. So I picked up 146 bolts then. That that is pretty bizarre. Uh, they can go in. The wire doesn't really weigh much. These things do. These sheets. And of course the scrap iron does. There's a zombie just there? It's brought down my weight a little bit. <laughs> they didn't even see me. Listen. You dill. Um, I don't get in the car. I want to search the car. Oh no. Jeez. I could just hear him. Ping off! Is it quiet? I can still hear some other noises in the distance. Yeah, these things are heavy. The alternators... Coils I don't think are very heavy. Them in there. Electronic circuits... Just pile them all in, Trev. I'll be fine. That's all a little bit more condensed now. Not obviously efficiently, but I won't worry too much about it. Yeah, it's the metal. The saw blades aren't too bad, but the metal pipes, jeez. These things are actually quite heavy. Oh, another 10 bolts. Uh, pressure, couple of pressure modules. Okay, still got a little bit of room in the car. Haven't got much of a hammer left. Have I got any hems left? Oh, I got one. Where where was I beating? Just here somewhere, wasn't it? Was it this? No, this one here, wasn't it? Do a little bit more. Well, at least we've tried. Two pressure modules and a anti-gravity core modules coming up, isn't it? Come on, think positive, Trev. Think positive. As the, as the sun comes up, so does the option to get an anti-gravity core module. There you go, see? There it is, right there. <laughs> ah. Damn it! Alright. Actually, hang on. What do I need to make another... Um... Oh, I just stick stones. Okay. Alright, so we just need some stones. Weren't we getting them out of the bodies from these guys? There you go. Um, uh, got plenty of sticks, plenty of wire still. Uh, wonder if the absolute herd of bodies is still around here. Oh no, most of it's cleaned up. Listen, I can see a body there. There's three stones. <laughs> it's so much easier just run around after the... Um, Hang on, is there two bodies there? Hmm. Is 
there's still that might be the girl that was there before Luna how's everyone else going? actually hang on a second one thing I never did can you buy an anti core module from these guys? barter oh it'd be expensive though wouldn't it? Yeah, look at that. 22 gold for a coil. Hey, there's a there's a cheap way of making money. Just use the coils from the cars and just go in here and sell them for 13 gold. <laughs> Didn't think it was that funny, but... Oh. Each to their own. Oh, the cargo person. Cargo master. Mm-hmm. So that's these two guys. Does this guy have anything? Little girl. Sorry, Ruxy. Trying to bard with you. There you go. Oh, is that all you got? Oh. Okay, that's not going to help much. Thanks, Ruxy. Unusual name. Uh, so that's three people. And Luna was walking around. Maybe that's all the people. So that's a petrol bowser just here. That's kind of interesting. You could build that up. Hmm. Never thought about that. Grab the pressure module. Uh, some coins. So what do I need? I need an, uh, an actual pump, and then four and two. That's easy. If I remember it. Models to do that while I'm here. Then I can get petrol from here. Over time, that is. Uh, what did I say? Um, one of these. Put that back in there. Uh, was it two? Hang on, which one was one and which one was two? I can't remember now. Let's just take three of that. <laughs> I think that's it. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Then I can come back here and just we'll have ten liters of fuel again. I mean, not initially, but eventually, yes. There you go, that one... Oh, I needed four. Damn it! Two more metal pipes and you're done. Memory like a sieve drift. Two more metal pipes, which is right there. Drag that back into there, into there, and the bolts into there. 167, jeez. Hmm. certainly know where we're meant to come to get the bolt. Alright, so these last two... What have I got not... Oh, I've got ten litres on me anyway. Well, that's pretty cool. I've got another one set up now. Yay! Well, guess what, guys? I didn't actually get a anti-gravity core module. Beat the crap out of a lot of um, zombies in the area, though, but that was kind of fun. But yeah, I went, went through a bit of ammo. Uh, not too bad. I think went through about 70 bullets, 70, 80 bullets, something like that. What's that doing down there? Hmm... I don't know. Is there... Like, see, this almost looks like a... F well... Not really a full car. These yellow ones look more like a... Oh, I don't know. They, don't, they still look decayed, I suppose, but... Maybe because it's got some more paint on it? I don't know. If anyone knows, please comment. That would be good to know, you know, am I looking in the wrong place? Is there a particular car I should be... I see there's a green one way up there. Can I, can I climb these things? Can I get up or... See how there's a green one right on top? Like, does it make any difference? <coughs> Don't think you're really meant to Nothing. Typical. Hear that? What? It's kind of funny when they say that from time to time. Hear that? No. Hear what? Well, actually, hang on. There's a few in here. Hang on now. Just let me craft a few hammers. Alright. We're, we're a little bit protected in here as well. Don't know whether you'd call that a full car, but... Well, we'll do a couple more and we'll see. 
I always think it's a positive sign if you get the blue iron, but is that just nothing? Does that mean anything? I don't know. Two electronic circuits. Holy crap, that was loud. Pressure modules. She died. I have a feeling I picked up the other hammers that were a bit better durability. Holy crap! Buzz off, dog. Where'd he go? That was a hyena, right? Yeah. That's probably what the guy was shooting at. Where is the dog? There he is. Here, yeah, boy, here, yeah, boy. Mm hmm. <laughs> That's what you get. This is what this one will get. What was that? Just. I'm hiding in here thinking that I'm actually safe or safer. I'm in this little nested area here, and they still found me. Anyway, back onto this car again. Two alternators, there you go. I got two pressure modules before, didn't I, or something? Come on, Trev, this car's gotta have the anti-gravity core module. See? <laughs> uh, no. What about this one? Kinda good that I'm picking up some of the other stuff, though. Gee, yeah. Well, I don't know. If you can pick up lots of the coils, sell them for gold, and then go and basically pick up the... or, you know, buy them with the gold you've got from other things, then who cares? At least it, at least it works. You know, you've bought them. But it would be nice just to be able to come in here and just grab them off cars, but... So far it's kind of eluded me a bit by the looks of things. Very random number of coins that I get. Look at the bolts! I didn't think it was that funny. Yeah, that's a lot of bolts. Oh, anyway guys, I've tried, I tried, I tried, I tried. I went through a fair few, I guess. Um, that's the only thing I can think of. If, if anyone knows, can they comment? That would be great. Like, feedback on anyone else's experience getting the anti-gravity core modules from the cars. Am I in the right place? Is there a better junkyard? Well, that's the other thing. We haven't been to all the junkyards. This is the only one I've been to. Maybe the others are different? I don't know. Anyway, guys, I'm going to have to leave the episode here. Certainly hope you enjoyed it today. If you did, you can really help the channel out by smashing that like button for the video. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, you can mega help the channel out by subscribing. Alright, everyone. Thanks so much. Cheers.